Eastbound UP, Montour, Iowa. Yeah, this one's moving a little faster, priority train. I got the drone up to its max speed of 42 mile an hour. He's pretty much leaving me in the dust. Ah, there's a good shot. I'm going through the Meskwaki Indian settlement and crossing the Iowa River there in the old CNW overhead trust bridge you can see. Eastbound through Montour, Iowa, Reds Iowa train videos. Well, we got a crossover light there on track two. It's yellow at the moment. And I got a an eastbound approaching behind me here. He's just waiting for that baby to kick a green and gonna continue on his way, I would say. And we got the eastbound coming up. He's just waiting for that light to trip. Gonna take the crossover.
get caught up to him here so I can take him, see him take the cross over here. Good old load of black diamonds. Look like we got some Wisconsin public service cars here. She goes through town.
Hell, get the back end of with that drone again. That's a fun loaded coal train powered by the people, DPU in the in the mix in the middle. Great catch. Reds Iowa train videos. Well, Reds Iowa train videos here in Waterloo, Iowa. Christmas Eve Day 2022. We got the Iowa Northern pulling out of what they call B yard. He's going to go up to the Jackson Junction and get some headroom here and do some work, it sounds like. I'm going to catch what I can of him before it gets dark here. It's starting to get kind of late. Yeah, nice. Looks like we get the Iowa corn slug. Locomotive. I'm told those F40 locomotives, that last one there, those have a higher amperage in the GP38, so they'll use them when you see the slugs. Yeah, it's about five degrees out here in Iowa today. Got a pretty uh Pretty stiff wind out of the northwest, about 20 mile an hour, so I'm shooting this baby from the cab. So B yard, where this train's going around the curve there, that's how Iowa Northern gets to their Bryant yard on the south side of Waterloo. They can also get to O-Line by going this route here too. Looks like he's got a pretty healthy train today. Yeah, we got a little bit of snow this last storm we had. We got about three or four inches. The weatherman was off by about five inches. They're talking eight to 12 inches around here and 40 to 50 mile an hour wind gusts. We got the wind gusts, but we didn't get all the snow. That's a good thing though, that much snow and there would have been a lot of problems around here. There's your Iowa Northern pulling out a bee yard in Waterloo, Iowa. Christmas Eve day, 2022. Well, Reds Iowa train videos here. Cedar Falls, Iowa. Well, the day after Christmas, so December 26, 2022. Here, the Osage sub. This is the beginning of the Osage sub on the CN. Got the V plow out. Looks like it's on Illinois Central. Old Illinois Central uh, Grandola. I'm hoping to catch this before it gets dark, but there's about only another half hour of light left. Yeah, it'd be fun to chase this thing. I'd love to catch this thing on the drone. There's a decent amount of snow. We had a lot of wind here over the last few days, so 
There's definitely some drifted spots. Well, he's got the light on, so that's maybe a good sign, but... Oh, give him some time, see if we get lucky here off the Osage Sub in Cedar Falls, Iowa.